All right, thinking we can get to a little business. I've got my collage piece that I created with um, branches. I collected these out on my walks, just different leaves and berries, eucalyptus berries, pompous grass. You want to find unique things out when you're walking. I mean, flowering cactus, yucca, and just bringing it home, wrapping it around, you see here, this is exactly it in my piece. There, just brought it all the way around. Give it dimension and give it a life, preserve it, and be able to enjoy it for years and years. Palm trees and different flowers. Let them dry a little while. They were mostly dry when I picked them up. Beautiful sticks. Took an old pizza box or a pizza tray and uh, went ahead and collaged. I did a collage piece here. And you can see it's this character. Very happy, I would say. Doing some work with his barrels, brewing up. And uh, I just got them from magazine clippings that I found. These are free in town. You can always find a lot of nice things just walking in town. And Here's some eucalyptus bark. That, I'm pretty sure, was the inspiration for this piece here and down below. So, yeah, I went ahead and painted this image. And in my mind, I'm thinking, what a great story to be able to be inside of a tree and looking in or looking out. Being in the tree and looking out. And you can see this man working in this little basement or barn and very happy and content in life. Just enjoying everything and proud. And It is a surrealistic painting. When you get down to it, I've got the beautiful acorns here. Her nest would be out here where you are. And you're looking in and you can see the man working hour after hour, creating his brew. Not sure. Almost thinking it's like a whiskey or hard alcohol, but why would we want to bring anything like that into the world? And there are so many wonderful things that we can drink to improve our health and our stamina and our, allow our systems and immunities to be strong. So why not be like maybe a kombucha? I'm not a real fan of kombucha, but any type of warming drink, an apple cider, maybe he's making a nice vinegar, or wine. Why not wine? Everything in moderation. The special bottle was given to me by my uncle and I'm holding on to it. What does it say? 2008. Little purpose driven life. And this amazing wine here was created by my cousin, my very own cousin, Angela, up in Lompoc. She makes the most amazing wine. And I have my other cousins, Joshua and Joseph, that um, make their own beer up in Fresno. Do a good living there. Anyways, I thought I'd share. So proud.
But yeah, with this piece here, I did, I collected all of my, um, all of my branches and twigs. Use this product here, which I had. It's a mastic for tile work. I mean, why not? I applied it real heavy and thick around the outside of my collage and pressed into the, the product, my leaves and branches, and just had a lot of fun. My bark, I've got some bark here, you can see. And then after, after I'd pressed in the sticks and the pompous grasses and flowers and berries, I went ahead and laid a piece of plastic over it. And then I put rice bags for weight and I let it dry a day or two. It dried pretty fast. And then from there, I went ahead and just took my paints and just painted it up. I just kept going and going and going until I felt like maybe I was happy with the colors, which I am. That's an idea for you. I'm not, it's not one of my original ideas. Of course, there's plenty of YouTubers that do this and uh, just a lot of fun. But yeah, I'll show you a little more with this piece here, what I've done with it. Have you ever imagined being in a tree and looking out? Well, that was my inspiration here. This owl here is sitting in front of her nest, looking into the tree where she has all of her belongings. And she's friends, of course, with this man, who's a very happy person. He seems genuine and in tune with what he's doing in life. A video. I got a client, yeah, it's a video. Look at this, it fell in there perfectly. If you can hand me my picture. Yes, please. Take care, Dina. Being in Ojai and our town having one of the meanings as the nest, I couldn't help it. Once I seen this, I knew it was a nest. And I just had to go further with it so that we could stretch our imaginations and allow ourselves to become better people and inspire us for business. I mean, literally, wouldn't you love to have a business like this? Where you get to be inside your little dwelling and have the animals near you and do what you love on your own time. Wouldn't that be the best? Start a business, you could do it. From my heart to your heart.